I definitely had an unusual route in the MLS. So after after our season ended, there was talks about me getting GA deal, but nothing was finalized or anything. So, and I've always, I want to play in Europe. I've always wanted to. So instead of sitting around, like just waiting to see if I got it or not, um, I went straight over to England. I got a trial with Fulham. So I was there for a week or two. And that was, it was awesome. So I trained with them like five, six days. I went to three of their games when I was over there. So it was definitely a good experience. I was sitting in my hotel room, getting ready to go to bed, just getting up for training the next day and got a call email that I was gonna get a GA deal. So then, yeah, it definitely made it, it was interesting to say the least when I was over there with all the stuff that was happening. Going into the lottery, I didn't really know what was gonna happen because there were only like five teams pulled out of it. So I could have gone anywhere, but there was like a handful of teams like I'd want to go. And obviously San Jose was at the top of the list because it was my home, like home club. So but then, but their percentage was pretty low. So I wasn't like anticipating anything like too much. So when I got the call, and it was San Jose, it was definitely a welcome call. First game, MLS game I actually went to was a clash game at Spartan Stadium. And Crazy George was still only for like San Jose, so I remember that, but I went to a couple games. I think, I'm gonna say I went to a lot of games, but I went to a couple games a season, so I was, I was out there a decent amount. I'm the type of person where I don't really like cling on to someone and ask. Like I like to like learn through watching instead of like asking about like a bunch of questions every single day. Cause I like just to watch and study and see what he does. That some things he does, I it wouldn't work in my game, and vice versa. So I like to pick parts of like like I said everyone's game. And there's definitely parts of his game that I can incorporate in my game too. So that'll make me a better player as well. first touch on the ball, so just went out and collected it and was trying to hit Scott, but right when I hit it, I was like, oh, that's too far. So I just turned around and I heard everyone like start screaming and stuff, so I just turned around, I saw the ball in the net, I was like, oh, I think I scored. <laughs> and everyone came back and actually did score, so it, it was pretty cool, but I know from that side of the field, you can't see anything. So if I, so once I hit the ball, he couldn't see it until it pretty much bounced, so. A little bit of luck in it, so I'm happy about that. But just after after I scored, just try to keep a clean sheet, which everyone wants to do. So just got to stay focused and finish the game. But now that was the first time. I hit the post one time. That was kind of cool, but yeah, for first goal from goalie. So I mean, I didn't kick that far, so maybe if I get lucky once or twice more, that'd be, that'd be nice.